in future studies, we say, what do we want to do today to create the future we want tomorrow? And sometimes students don't realize that they can have a preferred future. They can work toward a goal. Yeah, every micro school, like the first day or two or three days, we'll do what's called the future me activity, where we make some sort of um, like a drawing or a vision board or a sculpture or something like that about what that future for them looks like to try to tie their daily activities into that preferred future. And I really love that phrase. Thank you for sharing that with us, the preferred future, because it's like, you don't control the future. There's going to be lots of things that happen, but it's okay for you to have this hope, right? And, and a lot of our motivation and drive and what we're, how much effort we're willing to put into our learning really is determined by how likely we think that that preferred outcome is and if it's tied to our efforts. Yeah, that's brilliant. And you're creating little futurists out of the students too, that they're starting to realize that they do have some say in what's going to go on in their future. 